It's wild sporting gear. And today, doesn't really fit, does it? I hope you're all doing well on this very fine morning. Um, selfie videos aren't really my field of expertise, but I figured I'd do something a little bit more unique for a uh, announcement slash future of the channel kind of video. So I'm gonna be announcing um, some upcoming projects that I'm gonna be working on video-wise. This cat follows me everywhere I go. <laughs> Much. Hey, buddy. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. Anyways, let's get into it, shall we? Let's take a nice little seat, shall we? Hopefully the birds aren't a little too loud. Like I said, it's a very fine morning. So the first thing I kind of want to talk about is uh, future upcoming videos. Now, I know most of you guys really watch my channel for my products, tutorials, videos, whether it's where I point out where to find the uh, specific airsoft product you're looking for, or to teach you guys how to make it yourself. So with that, I kind of want to uh, announce some of these upcoming videos that I hope you guys can look forward to. First up, I have two separate 3D printed magnums I'm going to be working on for the AAP-01. Uh, I also have the grenade launcher. I've had that for a while, but I need to start working on it. Also, I have a uh, Destiny 4Runner pistol that's being made by one of my friends at the moment. I think it's about time that I make another products and tutorials video third installment in the series. There's been a lot happening in the world recently, and unfortunately, that's been affecting a lot of things that have been on Etsy. Foundry Airsoft, Master Lemons. Apparently, I've been saying that wrong this whole time. I kept calling him Master Lemons like he's a lemon. I'm sorry, Master Lemons. I'm sorry. And uh, other creators that are on Etsy. I know the printing revolution uh, needs some help at the moment as well, so I'm gonna be pointing up some updates in the upcoming products and tutorials video. God damn, that is so loud. Birds, man. It's a fine morning, I tell you. I also want to uh, do a loadout video based off the gear I'm wearing right now. I kind of don't want to get into it too much because, you know, I kind of want to save that for the video. But I think I'm also going to be showing off the uh, airsoft gear that I have as well. Not just the loadout. All the things that I have on hand, like the Foundry Airsoft Magnum, my uh, Chrono Blaster, a battle rifle, etc., etc. You know, show off all the goods. And I also plan to make a new series called Loadout Showcase. Well, what is that? Well, that's gonna be showing off other people's Halo Airsoft loadouts. If you have a Halo Airsoft loadout that you'd like to be shown off on the channel, uh, contact me through, you know, Facebook Messenger, Instagram, Twitter, wherever you prefer. Contact me and um, we'll get something running. And uh, one of the last things I have on my list, just to kind of remind me of what I want to make, is um, the Airsoft Spiker. You know, for a while that's been haunting me and I've been wanting to make that out of the, uh, the Boomco Spiker for the longest time. <laughs> and I just never got around to making it, you know. I've run into a hurdle and ever since then I haven't uh, gone back to it. But I know the solution to how to fix that hurdle. And uh, yeah, we'll be seeing an Airsoft Spiker sometime in the future. And uh, back to the whole conversation about, you know, how I've been experimenting with videos as of late. I just kind of want to do some new things at times. I know most of my views and people that kind of know my channel know me from doing tutorials specifically, like how to build Halo Airsoft guns. And that's definitely apparent in my stats on YouTube. Whew. Wild bug had just attacked me. <laughs> Maybe this morning ain't so fine. Like a big beetle of some kind, I don't know. Anyways. Back to this board meeting. And well, just like you, I do want to be more consistent with those kind of videos. You know, how to make this and how to make that. And uh, where to find this and where to find that product. You know, I do love helping the community in that way. I try to do everything in my power to point out these things for people to find for themselves. Mostly because I believe Airsoft doesn't have to be super restricted to always you know, tactic cool, the most realistic things that people run, like M4s and AKs and all that stuff. You know, I feel like people should be expressive with their loadouts, just like I am, no matter what sci-fi franchise that is. I feel like eventually I will branch out to other uh, sci-fi franchises. You know, I don't want to be restricted to Halo at all times, because, you know, there's other franchises that I do like that are out there. You know, Aliens is definitely one of them. But the heart and soul of this channel is definitely going to be rooted with Halo at the end of the day. But I just want to say, I am eventually going to want to branch out to other, um, you know, sci-fi products and tutorials for Airsoft specifically. I thought that would be fun, you know? That that needs a bit more um, light to be shined down upon the other sci-fi franchises. And now we get into the main meat and potatoes of this video. The main announcement that I kind of wanted to tell you guys today. 
But the reality of the situation about the products and tutorials and the videos that I make, um... God damn it, it's a freaking beetle again. <laughs> Leave me alone! The reality of the situation is that building all these tutorial videos and doing all the product videos, um, it gets really expensive. And as an airsofter yourself, which I assume you're an airsofter or somebody that's kind of, you know, wound up in this hobby in some way, shape, or form, you understand that this is all expensive at the end of the day. And uh, all these videos that I've been making, you know, it's all been coming out of pocket. Unfortunately, I haven't been able to afford all these kind of videos. You know, it's hard to balance all this stuff with my personal life and the combination of my work life now as well. And that's why I haven't really been as consistent with these product and tutorial videos as of late. So with that whole understanding, um, the main announcement for today is, well, I'm officially launching my own Spartan Just Patreon. Realistically, the situation is whenever I keep making a tutorial video about something you guys want, like let's say the MA40, for example, this took me a very long time to make. It would take about a week or two to make it, but based off my time frame of balancing on my work life and my personal life, and based off the income that I actually make myself, it definitely took a lot longer than two weeks, I can say that. Because of the ammo counter, which cost around 50 to 60 bucks, this Nerf MA40, which at the time I'm pretty sure it cost around 50 bucks, but now it's kind of increase to around 90 or 100 because they're a little harder to find and including the airsoft gun i gotta put in this thing by the way i just kind of wanted to show this off real quick master chief himself signed this it's beautiful i just kind of wanted to bring out the ma40 as an example i also wanted to add here that youtube monetization whenever it comes to airsoft youtube channels is <laughs> it's almost a joke uh, if you look here based off the stats you could see that most of my tutorial videos have the yellow dollar sign, meaning that I only really get like cents per view whenever it comes to these videos. And the ones with the green dollar signs barely gets any views at all. <laughs> because most people wanna watch the how-to videos. Reason being is sometimes YouTube doesn't wanna associate Airsoft with uh, most advertisers because they think that Airsoft is closely resembling an actual firearm, which is unfortunate, especially for the people who know the difference between the two. So what is this all going to fund? Well, essentially, it's going to be funding the product and tutorials, like this MA40, for instance. The events I go to so I can record gameplay footage. It also goes into the gear that I even get from other people that want me to review their products. These Magnum reviews and the Battle Rifle, those aren't free. This is all going directly into the Spartan Just channel and nothing else. Please know that I'm not trying to force you into, you know, supporting or donating to the channel. If you want to, that's completely up to you. I'm just kind of telling it how it is, realistically, you know. But if you do want to support the channel in your own little way, well, let's get into the Patreon tiers, shall we? So let's get into the first tier. First tier, if you just want to be supportive and you don't want any benefits about the Patreon, uh, well, you could join the Rat in enthusiast not my original idea but it's pretty funny second tier noble marine you guys just want a little bit of benefit while I was trying to support the channel now you'll be able to see some behind the scenes of some of my projects before I even go out to the public with it third tier hell jumper you get a little bit more than just behind the scenes you also get your very own Spartan just patch for free provided by tactical imaging these PVC patches represent the channel's logo. As a hell jumper, you'll have the option between the neon green variant or the new and improved upcoming dark variant. For my final tier, well, that's going to be my Spartan Brethren. Spartan Brethren. Now, this is the highest tier of my Patreon. The unique thing about this tier is you get the benefits of the other tiers. However, my Spartan Brethren get to have a very unique patch just to signify that they are indeed Spartan Brethren. I'm not gonna be releasing this patch for anybody else. It's only gonna be for the people who sign up for this tier specifically. But that's not all. Biggest benefit about this tier, well, let me just give you a little bit of a showcase. Introducing the Brethren Raffle. With the first offer being the brand new Foundry Airsoft Magnum Kit, having an improved sleek injection mold, more room in the SOCOM silencer for tracer units, and a one-size-fits-all improvement for the Gen 17, 18, and 19. This 
it's just the beginning. That's right. I would like to announce that for the Spartan Brethren tier, you guys will be the only tier that gets to qualify and benefit off of raffles. And not just any raffles. This is gear based off products like the Foundry Airsoft Magnums and possibly the Battle Rifles as well. I also want to incorporate this raffle because, you know, I can't hold on to all the things that I do reviews and tutorials for. So I'll also be giving away those in raffles as well. And honestly, for the Magnum donated kindly from Foundry Airsoft, thank you so much. Since this Patreon is just now starting up for the very first raffle or even the first couple of raffles, it's gonna be very easy to win just because of the amount of people that will be joining at first. I, I'm telling you, it's a steal. My target goal for these raffles would be possibly once a month if I can make it that and if I could get, you know, enough quote unquote sponsors to help me out and donate for those just to possibly advertise their uh, sci-fi products. Uh, if you're interested, contact me through Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, whichever way you want, or through my email, and we could possibly set something up. These are the four tiers of the Spartan Just Patreon. If you'd like to support, I'd really appreciate it. It would seriously help speed up the process of my products and tutorial videos, the quality content that I know you guys really want to watch. And like I said, at the end of the day, out of all of this, all of it goes straight into the channel. None of it goes into my own personal gain. But if you don't want to become part of the Patreon, that's completely fine. I'm not going to pressure you into it. I'll still be making content for my followers and the people that are interested in the content that I make. But the reality is, this is definitely going to speed up the process of that kind of content. If you do decide to become a Patreon, um, the other benefits for essentially all the tiers is that I'm going to be giving you credit at the end of all my videos. And you also get voting priority for the content that I essentially have down the pipeline. So whichever you guys want to come out first, I'll prioritize that. Um, I would also like to make a creative cinematic outro for all my Patreons. Um, I have a creative scene in mind, but it's just, it's been hard to locate the right animator for the job. Any recommendations is definitely helpful for that. Also, I feel like it's become a running joke for the channel itself saying, oh, you know, in the future, I'm going to make this. Oh, in the future, I'm going to make that. Well, this is definitely one of the reasons why I haven't been. And for the conclusion of this video, I want to say that I'm pretty proud of the fact that I've actually been able to help some of you guys with whenever it comes to the knowledge about how to find these products and tutorials and how to teach you how to make your own Halo Airsoft gear. It's an honor to become a motivator in this kind of stuff. The fact that I've been able to inspire more people to express themselves in their own way whenever it comes to Airsoft. It's seriously a privilege. I am all about trying to help people be more creative in this hobby. And I've learned this lesson through most of my friends that I've actually met through this hobby. Redshirt being one of them. He's definitely my personal biggest inspiration in all of this. You know, I kind of want to do my part in this hobby. And hopefully you guys can help me along through this journey. But yeah, thank you guys for listening to me ramble about all this, you know. And I kind of wanted to talk about what's been restricting me from making the quality content that I usually make that people enjoy watching from my channel. Yeah, don't forget. This is truly Combat Evolved. I'll see you next time.